Roswell Flight Test Crew here at the Commercial UAV Expo 2024 in fabulous Las Vegas, Nevada. And I'm over here with Arangang at the Swiss Drones booth. How you doing, Arangang? Good. How are you? <laughs> I am very good. And I must confess, yours is one of the first booths I came by here at the show because you've got this helicopter with a really unique rotor configuration. I've seen drawings of something like this in books, but I've never seen one in real life. So sort of describe it. So we are basically using an intermeshing rotor design. Uh, Carmen KMX is also uses a similar design. Uh, the inspiration came from them. Uh, this design gives us about 20% more lift capability compared to a conventional uh, trail rotor design of, of a helicopter. Uh, so this gives us almost one-to-one -one ratio of empty weight to payload. Um, and it is, it's really good for long endurance, high payload missions. All righty. Now this may be a stupid question, but why don't those two propellers just rip each other apart once this thing gets going? So the the two of the rotors are mechanically locked at 90 degrees, phase shifted, so they cannot uh, they cannot touch each other uh, unless they have a mechanical failure in, inside. <laughs> well, <laughs> let's hope that remains true. So the, then the next question becomes, if the two rotors are locked and ro always rotating at the same speed, how do you manage aircraft yaw? Each of the blades has pitch links, so they can uh, in individually uh, set to a different pitch angle. So you can adjust pitch of four different blades, and uh, we manipulate the pitch uh, to get the yaw. And that, so, that, so you can sort of make a yaw out of it? Correct. Amazing stuff. All right, so now that we get over my sort of shock and awe of the airframe, tell me what it's all about. This is obviously a, a large UAS. This is more than 55 pounds. Correct. It has a maximum takeoff weight of 192 pounds, uh, gives us about 80 to 90 pounds of payload capacity, including fuel, and has maximum endurance up to three hours. What's the uh, cruising speed? Uh, cruising speed is about 25 knots. All righty, and then um, what, what are the use cases for this aircraft? Who's, who's employing it? Uh, the main use cases we are focusing on is aerial uh, surveillance, search and rescue, as well as uh, linear infrastructure inspection. So what's this uh, payload you've got on it here at the booth? Uh, it's a LiDAR plus a phase one camera um, for auto photo plus uh, LiDAR uh, point cloud. All right, so that would be obviously for your surveying, etc. Correct, uh, as well as for power line inspection, pipeline, and, and so on. All right. Well, thank you so much for taking the time. It's an amazing looking machine. I hope those rotors stay locked. Thanks very much. Thanks. Thanks for coming. <laughs> <laughs> and from the commercial UAV Expo 2024 in fabulous Las Vegas, Nevada, this is the Roswell Flight Desk Crew signing off.